What's up guys, Mauricio here with Ignite Heroes and today we're swinging the Inferno Balanced. This is just like the other bats, the other axe that we swung, this is a long barrel. It's a 26 ounce and it feels so true to weight, true balance, 100%. Um, we're super excited to swing it. We've been swinging a lot of axes lately and they got a lot of good stuff out there on their website. So if you're skeptical, just go do it. Just make the purchase, 100%. Um, we're gonna fill with 300 all the way around. We're swinging some 52 300s, a couple pro a couple classic gems towards the end. We're gonna try to get this thing nice and broke in for you guys and then swing those uh, true harder balls down the end. You don't wanna swing something too hard out of the wrapper just because the composite's gonna break up. It's gonna start getting some web and you could eventually get some cracks in it, um, which you don't wanna do. The weather is about 54 or less, 50 to 54. Um, the weather is a little chilly out here, so it's gonna test the durability of this bat. Um, this has the flared knob, not the ax knob. Um, and yeah, I mean, I'm excited to swing it. I hope you guys are excited to watch this video. Please like and subscribe. There's about 75 to 80% of you guys that are watching this video right now. Right now, I'm talking to you, sitting down on the couch, eating some chips and drinking a beer. I'm talking to you guys. Just look at me dead in my face. Hit the subscribe button, it's okay. I mean, Dylan's zooming in just so you guys can see. Hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the notification bell. Please support the channel. No, I'm just kidding. If you guys like what we're doing here, please support the channel and check in for the video. Appreciate you guys. All right guys, nothing to say. I'm gonna just get right into it, Ax is him. So my expectations are through the roof. 81 miles per hour. Dude, you need to swing. I know. It, when you swing this, you're going to realize that that dual stamp one is really tight. 90 miles per hour. Yep. About 60% swing, just letting the back do the work. Because axe is just like that. 77 miles per hour. And that's the cool thing about swinging a balance that, man. We're just smashing gaps, dude. We're just having fun, you know? 85 like miles per hour. hour. Just... 40 miles power. per hour. I mean, whatever, dude. Welcome to the League Night Heroes podcast, where we just talk. I mean, and whatever, dude, like. Talk. 83 it's miles like, per hour. It just makes the game so easy when you get an ax hand, ax in your, in your hands. If that explains on how good ax bats are, I'm over here, I'm over here joshing around, not even taking this crap seriously, and I'm hitting like 90. And that's first couple swings with that bat. That's what I'm saying. He hit some Joe Schmo balls, dude. Like me, these uh, balls, these balls have been marinating in the garage in the Texas heat and humidity for like seven years. It's going like Texas heat, Texas winter, Texas heat. I mean, my in the battery same day sometimes. My battery doesn't survive that. Yeah. You, know? <laughs> you know when you're like, God. <laughs> Insert clip of uh, Witwicky. Sam Witwicky. <laughs> Username ladiesman127, that's me. Dude, tease him. All right, let me lock. 79 miles per hour. That's going. That's up. That's good. That went over the trees. That sounded very good. It hit the backside of the trees. 87 miles per hour. Yeah, that's gone. 39 miles per hour. Here's the good thing about the great thing about balance bats, um, especially if you're a guy that kind of hits hard, like your boy. Uh, Shout out your boy. No matter where the ball is pitched, bro, I can just do whatever I want. Like, if it's pitched on my face, I'll just turn on it. No problem. If it's, back, if it's on the outside plate, I need to go backside. I'm hitting your pitcher. That's his fault. You know? <laughs> if, you, if you hit the pitcher, it's his fault. Pitch me inside, though. <laughs> it's on you. Doug, your bucket's playing over there. He knows. Yeah, dude, he, he knows, huh? 88 miles per hour. 93 miles per oh, hour. That ball went flying. See you later, ball. 95 miles per hour. Dude, that ball was coming. 99 miles Woo! per hour. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 98 miles per hour. 
That was that center, was, center field's like this. You know what's crazy? His center field might be like that, but that ball was kind of going like this. So his, you know, first steps back. Same spot. Listen, I I don't know what you guys are doing to break these axe bats. I guess you guys hit way harder than me, but I'm swinging as hard as I can. Things are fine. It's totally fine. Things going. It only lasts ten swings. You don't know what you're talking about. Straight up. Oh! Yeah, it was. Ninety-nine miles per hour. Dude, ninety-nine. I don't know if you guys know this. Ninety-nine with the balanced bat is crazy. That's like one oh seven with the with the end load full out. Like, it's up there. Yeah, it's when you're swinging a balanced bat that's really balanced. And it's that's all you. Truly balanced. It's all you. And having some end load, like a half ounce or full ounce, the bat helps you a lot. And the fact that this thing is a toothpick and it's hitting ninety nine. I mean, come on. What's beating this? Eighty-seven miles per hour. Wow. I'm, I'm actually really liking this. I didn't think I'd like it as much as I'm liking it right now. You didn't what? I didn't think I'd like it as much as I'm liking it. Told you, bro. I was kind of... It's just like, I'm just like waiting so long, and I'm just like, just straight torque, bro. 106 miles per hour. beating it what's beating it there's nothing close dude like the one piece tantrum that's failing at 160 didn't feel this good the worst watermelon i love that bat it did not feel this good 107 miles per hour double seven back to back 94 miles per hour god please get another one go smell it 91 miles per oh, hour. Get ready. Get set. This ball's going out of here, dude. 97 oh, miles per hour. hour. Don't worry about it. We're good, dog. 98 Jeez. miles per hour. Ah! 92 miles get per two hour. More. Get you two more, buddy. All right, get you two oh, more. Hit the light pole. Hit the light pole. Keep it going. Oh, hit oh. it. <laughs> I can't hit that. <laughs> I couldn't know what ball was doing. What I was doing here. 84 it's miles go. per hour. It's gonna go. Keep it going. Last 43 one, last miles one, per hour. See ya. 89 miles per hour. <laughs> oh my. Hey, that. Hey, right here, bro. Right here. You gotta admit that pigeons. <clears throat> 93 miles per hour. 93 first swing is crazy. Great start. Great. Start. 94 miles per hour. We're running, boys. We're running. Good, man. I think it's good. 78 miles per hour. Come on, let's go, huh? Maybe. 76 miles per hour. 36? No way it goes. Okay. 87 miles per hour. Let that. 91 miles per hour. Nope. 86 miles per Ooh. hour. I'm sorry. I it's didn't a, realize that was your pitch, buddy. It's a balance. 87 miles per oh, hour. On, 93 miles per hour. 83 miles per hour. 98 miles per hour. Okay, here we go. 86 miles ah, per hour. That was a piece, my boy. Two more. 101 miles per hour. Nice 95 miles per hour. 97 miles per hour. All right, guys. Um, once again, bro. Ax Inferno, uh, guys, just keep putting this technology in bats. I don't care what load it is, full ounce end load, balance, half ounce, long barrel, short barrel, it is gas. Um, 
I hit 107, 106. The dual stamp hit 107. Dual stamp hit the 107. I think you hit 104, 104. No. No? Mm -hmm. Maybe. Dual stamp hit 107. The light blue hit 108, 106, 104. I mean, it doesn't matter. It, it's lighting up the radar. Like, we swung a lot of bats, and you guys, you guys really wanted a, a list that we really believe acts bats right now are number one. Um, we haven't got our hands on Louisville's. I know they're a very big competitor. Uh, we'll get our hands on them uh, when it gets warmer because those will break. Those will break. But these bats, um, people will have questions about durability all the time. I've had people literally tell me to my face that they know a guy that broke it in 10 swings. I have now swung six axe bats and swinging the hell out of them. They're fine, they're fine. And my light blue one has about 150 swings on it. It's testing at 260. So they're holding compression. Uh, the barrel is the barrel is really dense, really hard. You don't really get that real soft. A, lo a lot of companies are coming out with more softer barrels, you know, kind of more game ready. These are more harder, uh, stiffer, and they are very forgiving, which is very cool. Um, the flared knob, I am really enjoying it. Uh, like we've been saying, man, if you guys want to try an axe bat, like you're not too sure if you like will like the traditional axe, try the flared knob. It feels, like I said, like kind of more of a middle ground. It feels honestly like a normal bat. And I actually like that a lot because I know there are some guys that don't want to switch over completely, but they want something that they can go from this to a normal bat. So it's a really, it's a really cool thing that they did there. And I really hope they keep making the flared knobs. Uh, but yeah, man, the balance bat, you guys know I like balanced bats, especially when they actually are balanced. This thing is a toothpick. It feels really good in the hands. And like you saw in the video, man, no matter where the ball is pitched, I can get the barrel on it all day. I might not get the highest velos consistently with a balanced bat, but I can definitely catch barrels and hit mid to upper 90s, like usually. So it's a very good base hitter bat. And if I do need to send it, it definitely has the pop to do so. So if you guys are balanced bat hitters, or you guys want to try a balance bat, this might just be the one to go get. So go grab you one. All right, guys, so it, it's crazy. Um, the combination between all three, knob, balance, and the, in, uh, the end cap here, it, 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 you have so much control. Just having the command to be able to do whatever you want with this bat, the whip, everything. I mean, it's, it's insane. Um, hitting 100s for me is kind of crazy. I haven't really touched that in a while and hit my PR with an ax bat, um, which is 102 and this hit 101, I believe. Yep. Um, and this is when no end load. So, I mean, if you guys can, you see me at league, sometimes I yip up and sometimes I might hit hard, but if you guys compare yourself to me, you guys see videos of us in game. I mean, if you guys are comparing yourselves, we're some average guys. I am class D. Not D elite, not C, I'm class D. So that just tells you guys, the viewer, that I'm just an average D player that plays tournaments and swings the crap out of this bat and it does very well. Use code LNH to get 20% off of your Axe bat here. Go pick one up. Some people were asking about the balance and the balance is him. I might bag this one, I'm not sure. Um, yeah, I might bag it. Check it.